Good morning, good afternoon, good evening all around the globe. I'm Patricia Parent from Regina, Saskatchewan, Canada. And as you know, I'm grateful, thankful, and blessed to be here with you today. And today is December 28th, 2022. Whoa, what a week. It's been awesome. And my topic today and scripture is in Proverbs 9, verse 9. Chase wisdom. Teach the wisdom, and they will become even wiser. Teach good people, and they will learn even more. So when we stop and think about that, the moment a person decides they can't learn anymore from someone in the in the moment they stop learning at all. It's the openness to being taught that makes the wise men. The wise people never stop learning, never stop exploring, never stop seeing or doing. Never close yourself off from learning something new. Not even from those who are younger than you in their moments of frustration or failure, you can learn, you can lead, you can learn to love well. You can learn through um, explorations, eagerness, anxiousness, and you can ask God to put someone in your path who you can learn from today. So I always say, teach me daily, Lord. I want to open a new understanding. Humble my heart so that I can learn from anyone. You know, wise people have a irresistible hunger to be taught. They understand that they are not the experts on everything and that there is always a person with more experience, more knowledge, and more passion. You can learn from your triumphs and your celebrations, your failures and your difficulty. I don't like to call anything a failure because it's always a learning lesson. You can learn to stop putting pressure onto yourself and instead rejoice with the lifelong education. Chase wisdom. Never arrive at it because there's always something to learn. So God help me today, tonight, tomorrow, and forever to chase after wisdom. I don't want to stop learning because there's so much technology out there and there's so much wisdom. We never want to stop learning. It doesn't matter the age from one to 151, if that's what the Lord gives us for for years. So can you think of someone um, you can learn from today? I learn each and every day through the Bible with Jesus. Also, I learn every day with the opportunity that I was given over four years ago with On Paso. Because knowledge is powerful. I learn from my grandchildren I learn from my children. I learn from friends, family, all over the globe. So wisdom is, you need to keep chasing it because knowledge is powerful. And you know, I really want to bring into um, On Passive because with the new technology that On Passive has and is offering to the globe, 
Knowledge is powerful. And when we keep up on knowledge and technology as it changes, on passive is anywhere from five to 10 years ahead of what we have today. You know, all our uh, total internet solutions are a single sign in under one umbrella. Never seen, never done this way before. They are remarkable. I can say this because I have been beta testing and using the products that are, we are offering for free, which is O-Net, O-Mail, O-Trim. Yes, we will have paid products, but why not start and test the waters with our free? Three for free. They are amazing. They are mind blowing. They are changing technology. And you will, will love them because of everything they do. They've never seen and never done this way before. And you know, I was listening to um, Chris Johnson's live today. Whoa, what a story he had, but a true story. So, you know, I've had some swelling in my hands and my feet today, and I'm not quite sure what's going on but that's okay. I'm a buffalo and I will face the storm. Thank you, Chris. That was a great way of sharing it because when we are the buffalo, we keep facing, facing whatever trials or tribulations come to us and going through the storm. Look at what Jesus went through what he sacrificed. Look what so many go through, whether it's an illness or a disease or the technology our CEO has brought to each and every one of us and for around the globe. Because he has faced the storm and he continues. He's the buffalo of Unpassive. Thank you, Mr. Ash Mafara. Because now, through Chris Johnson with his story, we are all the buffalo and with heart because that's what On Passive was built with. And Jesus is the heart of it all because he leads us each and every day. So folks, let's keep chasing the wisdom. Learning, learning, learning new technology, new finding more in God's word in the Bible. But you know what? I am excited for O Connect to come because I love to teach God's word. Not so much teach it, but share it. Share it all across the globe. And with when O Connect is our uh, web platform, I will be able to share God's word in any language and it'll be translated from my English language to theirs, theirs, sorry, got to get the pronunciation right. So I'm excited for it, but you know what? Each and everyone out there, you should be excited for O-Mail, O-Net and O-Trim our email platform, our social network platform, and a, a shortener for your long lengthy your URLs and what they do besides just doing what we say they are. O mail, O net, O trim. They are so, so much more. I don't even know how to explain it because there's so much involved in these products they are a solution to the internet for each and every one. And I'm grateful, thankful, and blessed to be a very proud founder with OnPassive. And we all need to be thankful each and every day for what the Lord has given us. So for today, chase the wisdom, get to know about on passive because soon 
our magical links, our business links will be coming out for each and every one of us founders. And I'll be so excited to share, share, share with each and every one of my family, friends, and to everyone across the globe. Because there is something in on passive for everyone. It doesn't just stop at the three free products. There is so much internet solutions coming. It'll be mind blowing to each and every one of you. So everyone, can you think of someone you can learn from today? I'm hoping that you learned something from me today about the Lord and about on passive. Because I'm a child of God, but I'm also a very proud founder with on passive. So I like to reach out to each and every one. You know, we go through trials, but I chase the wisdom because the Lord gives me this so that I can breathe and keep going. Some days I look rough. I have to admit, some days I have swelling in my hands. I have to admit, but does it stop me? No, I keep going. Never give up on your hopes and dreams and your passions, never. Because my hopes and dreams and passion right now are to change lives, change humanity, make it better for someone, even if it's just one person, one family, one village, one province, or one country. But if I can do it, you can do it. And that's what the world needs because there is so many billionaires out there that are sharing, but they're not sharing enough to make a difference in the world. On Passive will make the difference with each and every founder that has the heart to give in every way. So let's each and every one be that buffalo. Face the storm head on. Keep going through that lightning, through that wind, through the snow, through the ice. Don't give up. Never give up on your dreams. Keep going. I love that analogy, Chris. Thank you so much. I want to send prayers out to Marty DeGarmo and his family. I know they're struggling with the flu really bad. And to a dear friend, um, Bruce, I'm not sure what you're going through, but I, I hear that you are. So my prayers to each and every one, and that's all I've heard for this morning, who is going through struggles. So my prayers are with each and every one, and also with Mr. Ash Mafar and his family. Keep being that buffalo, face the storm, because we all love you so much. And we are so thankful, grateful, and blessed to be a part of On Passive as founders and brand ambassadors. Thank you, thank you, thank you, everyone. Happy birthday to each and every one. There, I just lost my light, but that's okay. But I'll keep going and keep facing the struggles. But everyone, have a blessed day. Stay safe, stay warm, but never give up. Keep facing that storm. We are all buffaloes and we all need to keep going. God bless, take care to each and every one. And as I always say, we start here, we end here in eternity. We are here today. That is gone. This is not here yet. So for today, let's stand tall, walk together, hand in hand. Let's be united all around the globe. Never give up, never give up. Keep going, be that buffalo inside you with that heart. God bless, take care, love you all. Bye-bye for now.